Sure, so I'm Dev Amahad. I'm one of the co-founders and CTO. We're a team of technologies. We're a young company based out of Montreal, and we're doing 3D content creation tools that exist in the cloud. Uh, and what, what we're trying to accomplish here is the next generation of 3D content creation. So it's a little bit like um, how you would imagine Google Docs working, but for really rich uh, 3D advanced content. Here, what you're looking at uh, is a scene that we're rendering actually on one of AMD's very great cloud servers. But what we want to provide for the user in the front end is a really interactive uh, and visual experience. And we do that by also rendering the scene on the front end using the, the GPU of the client machine. So what we have here is an application that uses the GPU of the client, and then it uses the power of the cloud server in the background. What you're seeing here in the video up on top is some of the technology uh, that we have available. So we have realistic materials here. That's a, a gold type material. But there's also some hair and skin that we're able to do that hasn't yet been incorporated into the, into the browser application. But what you're looking at here are, are two uh, client machines. They're both looking at the same scene. So you see here, this user can jump in quite easily into the scene. It loads all of the geometry using the GPU into the scene to work with. But then they work uh, basically interactively. So you see, as I move, as I move the, the scene here, the other machine uh, updates appropriately. We have the flexibility now in real time uh, to discuss the results, we can decide, you know what, I, I love the product, but I'd prefer for the camera to be uh, more like this because it gives us a, a better impression when you're doing something like a, a marketing or pre-visualization of your, of your product. So the, the AMD Fire Pro GPU is critical to us to getting such a, a realistic image in such a short amount of time. So AMD has been exceptionally supportive of the, of the product that we're trying to create. I think uh, they see, like us, that this is the future of applications. We're going to have uh, some resources on a cloud server that are pushing along um, uh, what a thin client would then be rendering for a user. So they've been very supportive in helping us achieve that vision and moving faster than what we move otherwise. So there's a, another, another aspect to our application that's somewhat unique with uh, 3D composition tools that we use physically based materials. So what that allows us to do is get car paint that looks really like car paint. We also have the ability uh, to use a material that's a BTF material, that's the technical term for it, but a BTF material is, uh, is one that looks very much like cloth.